Alrighty then, welcome back and thanks for checking in with me, Nathan, here at Lewis Garden Services. Um, thanks to all the new subscribers. If you've liked the video, if you've commented on the video, thanks to you as well. It, um, it uh, means a lot. I'm on my own today. I'm going to do some um, patio cleans for a couple of our regular customers. It's not something that I do a vast amount of. I did renew my um, kit last year, at the beginning of this year, last financial year anyway. Uh, just because I had my old Karcher one for quite a few years and it uh, was a pig to start. Yeah, um, I'll get you a few clips, it'll be nothing exciting, but it's something other than hedges and cutting lawns. So I'm nearly here, so I will uh, go and I will show you what happens. Thanks for watching. Okay, so just um, leaving the first job, got that all done. Didn't uh, include many clips of that because the customer was in and out and there was uh, pots everywhere to shift, which was a bit of a pain. But um, I think he's got someone in to repipe the patio, so we were just more rather than well, cleaning it, but also blasting all the old joint, you know. Did have a bit of a false start with the old jet washer because I haven't used it for a good couple of months. Um, it's a tank fill. I mean, it um, draws from a tank, it's not uh, connected to the mains because it's 21 litres a minute. So it's a fair old whack of water it pumps through, but the pump wasn't sucking the water up. So I had one of those, oh, here we go moments, I mean, I haven't used a kit for a while. Give the guy a ring, uh, Terry from Jet Mac, he's over in um, Ireland actually, where I bought the kit from. Answered the phone straight away, gave me the advice I needed, got the pump going. So uh, thanks to Terry, I'll see if I can include a link to the package I've got, or at least his website somewhere in the description. So we're off to the second job now, just a couple of miles down the road. <coughs> I'll uh, try and show you the kit a bit better on this one. Um, I'm going to use a turbo nozzle on the back, paving area, and I'll probably use the flat surface cleaner, big, big old, I think it's a 20 inch wheel away on the front drive. The front drive is like a set type thing, um, so I'll have to re-sand that at some point. So yeah, jet washing number two coming up, all fun. Okay, so here we are, second job. Uh, this is the job to clean the back. Uh, the kit is a uh, Lonkin Lonson 14 horsepower motor. It's a Jet Mac jet wash, 21 litres per minute. Okay, so um, most households are like 12 litres per minute kind of supply, so it's best to fill that tank first before you start to uh, fire it up so you've got a bit of a backup, otherwise you're always chasing your tail.
that's the problem here is um, poor water supply Okay, so that's uh, pretty much all done. Just got to load up and clean up and make sure there's no muck all over the road when I move the van. Okay, customer was pleased. Uh, she said it looked cleaner. I didn't think it needed to clean, but you know, um, some people like to just make sure it is clean and they have it cleaned once a year. And um, that's one of those jobs I've got to drop back now and uh, re-sand that drive in a couple of days. Hopefully the weather will stay, stay dry. We'll take an hour to brush a load of sand in and um, blow the worst of it off. And again, it'd be great if you can give us a thumbs up, a like on the video, if you want to comment on it, great. Um, if there's an easier way that we could do things, please uh, let us know. Or um, if you think we're not doing it quite right, again, let us know. I'm happy for the good and the bad. Um, I will catch you on the next one. You take care. Thanks for watching.